Welcome back to another segment of The DLA in the News. Welcome back to another segment of The DLA in the News. FEMA leaders learn about troop support's capabilities during visit. March 22, 2023. Article written by Alison Vera Welsky, DLA Troop Support Public Affairs. Philadelphia. Leadership from the Federal Emergency Management Agency visited Defense Logistics Agency Troop Support, in Philadelphia on March 6, to learn more about the benefits of the whole of government program specifically during presidentially declared disasters. Student clients, welcome back to another reaction brought to you by the DLA Guru. Uh, in today's article, FEMA leaders learn about troop supports capabilities during visit. Uh, this is a, a very short article, however, very important uh, because I wanted to identify, or what, what I should say, what what stands out to me is that the DLA uh, is the world's largest customer and supports the United States government's military uh, and other um, stakeholders. But FEMA uh, is another potential stakeholder to that that's looking for support from the DLA. And for any government contractors who have tried to to get involved with FEMA from a um, supplies perspective. Uh, it's a very difficult organization to break into uh, in order to provide uh, consumable items that uh, would be available uh, or for purchase from FEMA to support disaster relief throughout the, you know, the country and the world. And so uh, when I ran across this article, I was uh, pretty excited because FEMA is now in discussions with the DLA as to how the DLA could potentially support FEMA. And uh, this particular paragraph really caught my attention. Uh, it's this paragraph, the second paragraph of this article where uh, the Diana Stewart, uh, who is the chief of strategic communications, um, she highlighted to FEMA that within the DLA, supply chain leaders from subs, subs, su uh, sustenance, clothing and textiles, medical and construction and equipment, uh, you know, they, they presented products and programs available to assist FEMA logistically. All right, and so these particular products or these, these commands or these, these teams within the DLA, uh, sus sustenance, clothing, and textiles, medical and construction equipment, these all link back to uh, the DLA's troop support. And the troop support command and here, let me switch to uh, this this page here on uh, within the DLA's website, um, the Office of Small Business Programs as it relates to troop support. Uh, my first thought is, in order to get involved with troop support, I highly recommend you reach out to the Office of Small Business Programs, let them know that you ran across this article um, regarding FEMA wanting to have support and if your company is able to provide uh, any types of clothing and textiles, medical construction equipment, uh, I would reach out to uh, this particular uh, small business programs office and, and inquire about the types of products that, that the DLA would be looking to procure to support FEMA initiatives. Uh, the article doesn't really go into that detail, but this is kind of how I would from a business development perspective would look at this opportunity. And uh, I'll put the link to both the article and this particular site, uh, this page in the description below where you can uh, basically grab the DOA's uh, troop support, Office of Small Business Programs, email address as you see on the screen. There's a toll free number. Uh, and then again, this gets into the different divisions within troop support, clothing and textiles, construction equipment, medical, and sustenance and their phone numbers where you can literally reach out to these offices 
say, hey, you know, I have a supply company. We're interested in getting involved to support uh, the DLA in, in an effort to support FEMA and how best to get involved. And if you, when you go to this particular site, they'll give you instructions to, to at least get the ball rolling. And it, and it reads here, if you have a question related to a specific buying activity of the DLA or want to send your, your company's capability statement um, to market your company, contact the DLA small business office associated with that buying activity, which in this case would be the DLA troop support. And um, yeah, anyway, I think that this is kind of a low hanging fruit excellent nugget if you're very interested in getting involved to support fema this may be a backdoor way of getting involved and at least getting products in the dla's hand so that when disasters are sure to come that uh the dla will be capable and ready with um, viable supply chain partners to support fema through the dla versus working directly through fema all right well that will conclude my reaction to today's article Hopefully you're enjoying uh, this particular auto narration series. Uh, by all means, I, I truly appreciate for all the subscribers who have subscribed and for those of you who may have you know, new eyes and ears on my content as it relates to the DLA, uh, by all means, you know I appreciate if you click the, the subscribe button, the like, and of course, share it with members of your team or other companies that are, are individuals that you think may be interested in an opportunity to, to change their lives, to get involved with selling to the federal government uh, by, by probably the DLA, in my opinion, is the, uh, the agency within the, the, the buying activity within the United States government that has the lowest barriers uh, to entry of any contracting office within the, within the United States government. For those of you who, who know about GSA schedules or BPAs or IDIQ contracts and, and things of that nature or just working through SAM.gov, uh, you will recognize that it's it's kind of difficult to get involved. Uh, you know, you bid, you don't win, but the DLA is, is very centric to small businesses. And, and again, FEMA buys a ton of products uh, for disaster relief. And if they're looking at DLA to be a partner, why not strategically position your small, medium, or large scale business to get involved um, um, uh, with the DLA to support FEMA? All right, so uh, with that said, um, again, this concludes my reaction. And um, by all means, if you guys are enjoying the content and uh, you want to, you know, just kind of drop me a little tip, uh, I, I have in my um, in, in in the description below um, my Cash App link, uh, which is at uh, the DLA Guru, and my Venmo at the DLA Guru as well as buying me a coffee. All those links are below. Um, all your contributions are highly, highly appreciated, or greatly appreciated, I should say, uh, for those of you who have uh, dropped the tip and for those of you who are who have not, hey, you know, please consider supporting the channel. Um, again, your likes definitely support it as well because that gets the algorithm kind of uh, liking the content and, and pushing out the content to more uh, interested parties who are interested in government contracting and opportunities to grow their businesses and to change their their lives as well as their families' lives. All right. Well, thanks again for uh, for watching, and I'll go ahead and switch it to the article so it can complete. And I'll see you guys on the other side. Diana Stewart, Chief of Strategic Communications, highlighted how the same logistical precision supporting warfighter lethality is available to federal government partners. Supply chain leaders from subsistence, clothing, and textiles, medical, and construction and equipment, also presented on products and programs available to assist FEMA logistically. We have the experience needed to make things happen, Stewart said. DLA is about solutions, more than just buying. DLA is an invaluable partner during emergency responses, that can procure quality supplies quickly to save lives. DLA has supported large-scale complex lines for over 40 years, she explained. DLA's modernized acquisition, and high-quality supply chain management, seamlessly supports warfighters and national trusted mission partners. FEMA's potential whole-of-government program partnership, would contribute to protecting stakeholders, by ensuring they have dependable products during emergencies. It would be helpful to only make one call for good generators said Julia Gammon, 
FEMA Deputy Director of Logistical Operations. Lives will be saved if we know supplies work as promised. DLA Troop Support provides more than $19 billion in support to 51,000 global customers through a network of 3,700 suppliers, delivering optimal, global supply chain solutions, with a focus on world-class performance and strong partnerships, in support of national defense, humanitarian assistance, and disaster relief. This now concludes another edition of the NMS e-learning systems, the DLA in the news. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our channel, and hit the notification bell, so that you can always be abreast of new audio narration segment releases, brought to you by the DLA Guru. Thanks again for watching. I'm Parker Winslow, signing out. Thanks for watching. Also, if you find my related content inspiring, please show your support by hitting the like, share, and subscribe button, along with the notification bell, so that you can be alerted when I drop new relevant content to empower you for success with the DLA. Also, by doing so, you'll help me reach a larger audience of people who may be also interested in learning more about government contracting and doing business specifically with the world's largest customer, the Defense Logistics Agency. Please don't forget to check out my flagship masterclass, Eight Steps to Successful Federal Supply Contract Bid Submissions to the DLA. This masterclass provides a balanced approach to virtual education and is designed for both beginners and seasoned companies alike with proven techniques on the best way to position your organization to being successful with winning federal supply contracts with the DLA. The masterclass contains three and a half hours worth of content along with proprietary and recommended software tools designed to empower you for success with the DLA. Check out the links provided in the description below to learn more today.